PJ Tour Live, Trey Wingo and Mark Wilson. Keegan Bradley, second shot on the 10th. Just outside 157, leaning anxiously. Is it a little left of the hole? No, it's a little right of the hole. It's a little perfect. Ideal. No, Keegan, looks like whatever's left for Xander, he's going to get a good read off this putt from Keegan. Ooh, that one rolls in. So we kick things off at the 11th for this group with Keegan. Okay, so I think ideally 15 feet left, pin height, right about there. That'll work. Beautiful shot there from Keegan. First of the day, but started on the back nine and got it going right away. Coming off birdie at 10. This to get it to two under after two. Well, the birdie number 10 right out of the back. And now he's got a 58. He's got to play a little right, and there is a little bit of a ridge that can kind of kick it left a little bit for him. I think so. Really well played there. Kind of like that? Yeah, exactly like that. Looking to go birdie, birdie, birdie to start his round. That's going to be a very popular name atop the leaderboard. Yeah. Sure will. He's still on pace for that 72 under par. Greens aren't crazy firm. Well, not only that, but he's made three straight birdies. He's got to be thinking green light. Did I hear the word perfect? I did. He ain't messing around. He's like, what did you, what did Phoenix shoot again? Was yeah. that 58? All right. Birdie at 13. This is the eagle attempt. And he probably wasn't too thrilled with that effort right there. And now Keegan Bradley, who absolutely striped it. Oh, and just didn't trust the stroke. That's true. He just did not. You're right. He kind of gave up on that one a little bit. See this one here on 14, Terry. This is another one of those elevated shots. You're up high. Full location on 14 is just on the front. You don't know whether you can stop it. Almost went in. Oh, absolutely. And it just puts, seems like it's putting so much pressure on, when you feel like you can't make it from five, six feet, especially up to that 12, 15 foot range, that classic birdie range. Starting on the back nine, and then this at 17 from 75 feet away, just under. Well, if you're from Connecticut, you know there's a roller coaster ride called Boulder Dash. It's over in Bristol. <laughs> <laughs> Fairway and Keegan Bradley. Just 88 yards after that, and now this whole location over that bunker. You, you got a little slope to use right of it, as if you want to spin a little hook in there. That'll be a pretty quick putt down the hill, but good distance control. Yeah. See the breeze freshening a little bit. Racing by. This Keegan. is quick, too. Did he? Oh, how sweet Walking was that? Down. How sweet was that putt that found the bottom? And he's gonna print. And he's playing a tour event and make that. 32, this on the way at three. Massive drive up the third to get it up on that level. Oh, so close. Look at those, both of them. All right, let's go back to Keegan. Just a little tap in to get him to eight on the par. Now Keegan from 152, just on the edge of that rough. Oh, taking dead aim. This is a little right of it, though. Okay. Oh, deep, too. All right, back with you, our leader, Keegan Bradley, on seven. And make it eight, as in eight under par. Keegan Bradley, 40 yards offline. The green that he's hitting to is right behind that tree that he just hoisted it over. Giving it the look like it's a little left. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, that's fine. Just which I've had explained to me about four times, and I still don't get it. But he does. Or is it adoration? Uh, they both. Adore they adore him. Look at that. Great for Keith. I love. Handle it, no problem. Now to the eighth tee, Keegan Bradley trying to work that in. Right to left. Oh, boy. <laughs> One way to do it. Oh, yeah. oh, Make it three for three. Boy, is he putting the lights out, isn't he?
You get to spend time with your family. He, actually, he was in Massachusetts doing a knot in Florida where he lives. Can't live out here this week and around it in. Well, I don't know if every viewer knows what aim point is, but when you see him hold those two fingers up and you make a four footer, no issues for Keegan. Yeah, he's got five iron. No more than Xander from 198. And he's trying to hold a cut in there. Smart play. Oh, great shot. My goodness, just covered that false front right there. Ten eagles yesterday here at the 13th. Three today, it's probably because of the hole location. It's a little more difficult today. Rain coming down, you can see harder. This is Keegan on the way with his eagle try. Now it's going to be low. It's about four feet or so for his birdie up the hill to get to 12. Yeah, very confident with that stroke. Smiley, did he say he has to smoke it or he smoked a similar shot to this? Well, it sounded smoked when he hit it. Yeah, <laughs> looks right at it. Well, did everything he needed to and wanted to do. It's a ground hook. It came a little left. Just rolling him in, Brad. They're making it look so easy. Putts going in the center. Visual of that grip. Get Trying it. to sling a draw. Turn hard. Using every inch of that tree, it wasn't Aaron just to try to use that angle to hook it a little bit. That's not too bad over there. And smiley, we see a good view here from behind Keegan, how dark it is, and you talked about the grain. And well, oh, that's got to go, Brad. Yeah, that, I was just saying that's got to be so slow, but it would have been so easy to take a sandwich and just stick it in the ground. Yeah, like a golfer, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Oh, is he rolling it or what? My goodness. He loves this hole. <laughs> Got to be a presentation now again. Absolutely. Come on, let's see it. Keegan Bradley just on a roll. Got it to 14 under. 8 iron from 166. Should be a perfect number for him. And this looks pretty good right at it. Oh. Ooh, the first player good. we've seen landed short of that hole location. Because that will go back in the rough some putt. So Keegan's made over 160 feet of putts already today. Add to the total. Automatic. Bringing this ball in low. It's definitely going to have a bunch of spin here. That sounded like good contact. Yeah, that is beautiful. Phenomenal shot. This for birdie. How about it? Has it changed? The routine has been perfect. You can set your watch to it for Keegan Bradley on the greens this week. It's been fun to watch. Keegan Bradley with his second. Yeah, that was from a clean lie there. That was also a nine iron from 168, trying to bring it in from right to left. Oh, wow. Yes, what a shot. Sir. Best one I've seen today. Just slightly back down the hill. Yeah, there's some on the right. Beautiful. Three paces to play with. This is one of four flags today. Three off the edge. He land on the fringe. Yes. Oh boy, that was really well done right there. Can't do any better than that. Can no, you? you really nice can't. Shot. Putter's never still there. A lot of these instructors want to make sure that your face alignment is perfect. The putter's never still. It's always bouncing. It's always moving. Keegan's a little like that as well. He says he's nervous all the time. <laughs> I believe least, it. At least he's honest. That's true. That's a three iron. So you can be fidgety. You still can hit great shots. All three of them, too. Superb. I think a lot of these guys thought they were going to be playing in some pretty miserable conditions. It's important to have that kind of a flexible confidence mindset when the weather does turn out well. A good effort there. Yeah, with these conditions, you can be a little over aggressive sometimes. Yeah. Just feel like every flag you can aim at. See a few people come adrift. This hole, for example. Get in the box. Got to, got to do it all. Yeah, aggressive swing. Oh, that's going toward the center of the green. How about that right? call be the right club. I know it's not. So got the ball back in your stance. Just let that toe roll over a little bit here. 
There you go. That was so close to perfect. It really was. At 20 under par, if he holds this. Well done. Brilliant up and down there. That was actually Dottie's phone. Hush. <laughs> Come on, honey. Oh, superb shot. Whether they played it for six yards, four yards, five yards, that is a great shot. That was a pretty good year. <laughs> Understatement of the year. Get in the hole. Nothing yeah. understated about that, too. Perfect inside seven feet so far this week. Keegan, 114. Big difference here in yardage between these two players. Tug it a little bit. Not much, if you want to say. <laughs> yeah, and he's going to get the line there a little bit from Shez's putt. See if he can separate himself. There it is. A little bit of different angle helps keep the ball from going to the left. Birdie for Bradley, up by two. Big gun. Big gun. Oh, it is. You can't play defense either, even with this two shot lead. And for the 19th birdie of the day on this fourth hole. Wow. I'm not so sure he needs all of this. It's only 241 front. Well, things going his way. Just carries the little mound, and that's good now. Really good. Chance, perhaps, for an eagle. Amanda up by the clubhouse, Mark Dusbavik with the rules, and we're right out to the sixth with this eagle putt coming up. Thanks, Jim. Bradley has not missed a shot. Every fairway, every green so far today, and that'll be tap in for a four. And that'll be his third birdie, Dottie, in four holes. Yeah, keeping his foot firmly on the gas pedal. He said yesterday that would be necessary, and he's doing it so far. Just one drop shot in the entire tournament so far. Back at the 11th hole with Keegan Bradley, downhill par three. This hole today, Dottie, has averaged 2.75. It has been a birdie fest. And it looks like another one here. He likes those left hole locations, doesn't he? He sure does. He loves that little baby draw. And it's another one. Now leads by five, and he's putting like Billy Casper. That is a pitching wedge in hand. Flighting it down just a little. Right punt. Oh my goodness, look at this. What did I say? He likes those left hole locations. Back at 12, Keegan to get to 26 under. Slightly up the hill. Oh, yes. Keegan Bradley keeps pouring in the birdies. Four left. Four left. This could be left of the bunker. Well, he's going to get up close and personal with those New England fans who love him so much. <laughs> On the hill, right under where you guys are sitting. Yeah, it's better under the umbrella, so what you're saying? It is indeed, with a gap wedge. That'll be good enough. Wonderful touch. New England's very own takes the title at the Travelers.
Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. To watch another video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.